mosquito populations are on the rise and West Nile is also on the rise. Spray is some. Concerns and questions arise after a community member saw this driving past his house last night. We detected West Nile virus in that area of the county, and so we were spraying with our truck-mounted ultra-low volume sprayer trying to knock down the adult mosquitoes that may be transmitting West Nile. Mosquitoes are a vector of concern in St. Joseph County because they can transmit diseases to humans such as West Nile virus and eastern equine encephalitis. The health department says spraying neighborhoods near where cases of diseases have been found is Vital. We spray uh, synthetic pyrethrins, which are in essence the synthetic versions of chrysanthemum flower extract. Which environmental health expert Davis explains is completely harmless to humans. People don't have to worry about, you know, rushing inside and closing their garage doors and all of that sort of thing. Most mosquitoes are active at night, so you'll see these trucks spraying mainly when it's dark out. We do spray um, in the evening or at night, so that way we are only targeting mosquitoes. We don't spray during the day because we don't want to affect any other non-target species. We don't want to, you know, we're cognizant of the bees, the butterflies, and all the other, you know, the nice insects. To find out when and where spraying will take place, the St. Joseph County Health Department website is the place to visit. We have that posted by 5 o'clock the day that we do spray. Um, we, that's, that's the only place that we currently post it, um, but it is on our website. I'm John Paul. Thanks for watching. Here's another video for you to watch. Also, please take a moment to subscribe to our channel.